Hi, today we are going to learn about INVD sample questions oral part. Question 1. Spindle shaped cells arranged in the form of whorls is seen in amyloblastoma, adenoamyloblastoma, keratocyst, odentoma. The answer is adenoamyloblastoma. Adenoamyloblastoma or adenometoid odontogenic tumor occur below 20 years of age. This tumor is associated with unerupted teeth and in over two-thirds of the tooth is maxillary cuspid. Adenometoid odontogenic tumor is histologically by the tubular or duct-like cells. These duct-like or microcyst lumina are frequently lined by eosinophilic rim of varying thickness and so-called hyaline ring. So the answer is adenometoid adenoamyloblastoma. Question 2. Lack of response of any level in the pulp vital vitality test can be used to differentiate it between the cementoma and the periapical granuloma, cementoma and incisive canal cyst, globular maxillary cyst, traumatic bone cyst. The answer is cementoma and periapical granuloma. Cementoma, it is also called referred as a periapical cemental dysplasia or cementifying fibroma. It is common in mandibular anterior teeth, seldom maxillary is involved. It is common in second decay of life and women are more frequently involved than men. The teeth exhibiting cementoma are vital. Radiographic appearance of cementoma during osteolytic stage resembles the periapical cyst or granuloma. But teeth involving periapical cyst and granuloma are non-vital. Answer is cementoma and periapical granuloma. Question 3. The compound the odentoma compound shows on a radiograph as supernumerary teeth, radiolucent and radioopaque areas, masses of classified areas, distinguishable tooth-like structures. The answer is distinguishable tooth-like structures. Compound odentoma occurs in anterior maxillary, maxilla and may be associated with unerupted tooth. Odentoma is of two types, compound odentoma and complex odentoma. Compound odentoma involves tissue, resembles the normal tooth. Complex odentoma, tooth have no morphological similarity with the normal tooth. So the answer is distinguishable tooth-like structures. Question 4. Which of the following tumors is most aggressive? Myoxoma, cementoblastoma, amyloblastic fibroma, amyloblastic fibroodentoma. The answer is myoxoma. Uh, odontogenic myoxomas, aggressive, improcious neoplasm derived from the embryogenic odontogenic mesenchyme pro probably arise from the dental papilla or follicular mesenchyme. Nearly all lesions are commonly found in the tooth bearing areas of maxillary and mandibular bone. Mandibular lesions are commonly found in the premolar and the molar area. The lesion often produce multilocular or radiolucency with a soap bubble or honeycomb appearance in the bone. The thin and extremely delicate septa of the bone are often seen to course through the radiolucent area and produce a spider web-like or tennis rocket-like appearance. So the answer is myoxoma. Question 5. Ghost cells are characteristically seen in the epithelial lining of radicular cyst, eruption cyst, keratocyst, calcifying odontogenic cyst. The answer is calcifying odontogenic cyst. Ghost cells are found in compound odontoma, amyloblastic fibroodontoma and craniopharyngioma. So the answer is cal calcifying odontogenic cyst. Thank you.